What sucks hmm. is I have to re-download the whole thing again. See the, I have the base game, and then the update that goes with it. Shit. We completed the base game, but because it, the Wi-Fi turned off, it, it uh, corrupted the data, if you will. Oh, and no. I have to delete it, and then I have to re-download it. Yeesh. Ah. All right, now we're back. Now we are back. And I am irritated as all living hell. Only one? No. I'm trying to think here, you doofus. Paper more in the t ten leg spike is back. Oh my god! And no kidding, some dudes. Let's go for one thousand. No, let's not go for one thousand legs, some dancer. That's the second time tonight I've tried to stream, and my router has a hiccup on me because of the. Fucking Texas weather over here. It's like... I checked my weather app. It's not even cloudy. Clear skies. It's 80 degrees, but it feels like 88. Makes no fucking sense. But then again, Texas weather never makes any sense whatsoever. And it pisses me off. It's the frickin' weather. I'm blaming the weather. Are the weather or the weather? Okay. Or both. Potentially. I could talk to Astound if I'm about to update for the router. Because we've had that router since we moved in back in November. Oh Jesus, that one that was close. Oh. Eh. No thanks. Oh, I have enough, so I'm just gonna use it. Thank you. 
Yep. I don't have enough space in my inventory. With the power of Mario's stand. Oh god. No, we're not making a freaking JoJo reference. No. See, a guy we used to work with ruined JoJo for us. Yep. The only... He would pester us into watching it. I mean, if he just said it once, I would have been like, okay, I'll take a look. But he kept pestering us even if we did watch it. And we just, like, okay, it's not worth it. Yeah. Sudden art attack. Oh, he's talking about the freaking stars. That's what... <laughs> Okay, that that one I'll give you a pass for. Restores fifty flower points. Uh, let's get rid of one of the earthquakes. Eventually, at some point. Then they turn into a really old, really old lady, you know, guy. What the fuck? I'm not kidding. He looks like, oh, he looks like a grandma. <laughs> no offense, anyone. It's too far. Probably actually looks like that. You know, like, wow, they done you wrong. Forgot his name. Why? I'm like, no boy. What a fool. Very funny. I don't know. Though I remember the uh, from the original Dragon Ball, he had uh, Android. Yeah, 16, 17, and 18, and then there was 19 and 20. I think it was 19 that was the old guy. I don't remember. I only know 16, 17, 18, and 21. That's it. Yeah, it was 19. <laughs> Oh god. He beats you or lost it. Let's put me together and find either way. Pure genius. Now, I thought the three shadows would do a little more to slow your progress. But it appears they're so useless that even this small task was beyond them. No matter. I get the pleasure of sending you to oblivion. Watch your back, old boy. This burly fellow looks rather robust. Once you fools are gone, no one will stand in my way. Grotus will rule the world. And Grotus will rule the world! <laughs> okay, that's a lot better than what I do. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> send the answer says, watch your back, and then comes Mario's boot. Oh god, yeah, that's true. I'm gonna take my paper thin boot and shove it up straight up your candy ass! 
Oh, I can't damage him first turn. Shit. Let's just check on these motherfuckers. Three, four, and zero. What the fuck? They attack? Shit, I didn't remember that. Yeah, it gives me an info on the enemy that I lock onto. Oh yeah, well, I figured that out, but I thought it was like, uh... You can't do that. I think that's effective. Oh, Jesus. I thought it's Yeah, it's only two though, so he needs four in order to activate the shield. Then check on Grotus. How much HP you got? <laughs> no. Yeah, he's he's Hundo dead. Come on, let's beat him and find Peach. Yeah, uh, I think I got that covered. Yeah, there we go. It's just three hits and he's gone. says next kind of clarifies that. With one step and she will breathe no more. Yeah, I got a Yeah, got an old fire alarm so uh give me one second. I'll be right back, guys. Or, 
I'll pass on that one. Of course you pass on that one. But the idea of po potato salad from Terry, that actually is, that actually sounds good. Or uh or, because uh green olive and potato. Oh boy. Minimum cheese sandwich it is. Get get some of that. Have my mom make some uh homemade chicken salad. And then uh a little bit of the egg uh the margin of the egg salad. And then play some poker while eating dinner for the fish. No, you're you heard. Roasty dad, roasty you. You've done it to me too, so. I, I, he knows I. He knows he has flaws, and I know he has flaws. <laughs> no, he knows I have flaws. I swear to God. But uh. What Sundancer just said? What? When I beat Grotus with only three hits, he uh they typed in saying uh Mario dialogue. That's just a skill issue. <laughs> uh, like, and that's just only 10% of my father. Who are you, Shaggy? No, Tallahassee. <laughs> I think Tallahassee would take the Shaggy ass if you think about it. Which version of Shaggy? OG or multiverses? Which is like the god OG. form? Oh, both. I feel Tallahassee is like, he's like from Zombie Land. I feel like he. <laughs> So much shit and somehow walks away like this. By the way, one more boss fight B before I have you to get think, to the final one. You think I'm the final boss? You might look like the rock! Look who's dropping! Oh crap. It's Dwayne Johnson! He's the true final boss! Oh, that was a surprise. Oh, I didn't think I'd fall. Crummy ancient tower construction. You're impactfulness. Are you okay? Do I look like okay? Do I'm okay? You old hag! Why is Mario here? Just... Wait, why is Mario here? And Peach as well? Uh, I don't know what's going on here, but I'll get put into it right now! You gotta run it for, for me, Mario. First I'm gonna pound you, then I'll take your princess, and then those crystal stars. Uh, not in that order. All this Amp Bowser 2? <laughs> oh, we're not from Battle Mario? Yes. Easy. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. Man. You're doing good? Oh, sorry. Today, today, I flush a plumber down the drain. Not, uh, not my Battle Bowser. <laughs> <laughs> Mario kind of smells like that, so I guess no change at all. What is a finale without me? <laughs> Technically, he's not. By the way, I need a peach for hours. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ. You shouldn't have to turn on. But for my case, that's not. <laughs> I have got a fruit. <laughs> she took it. She <laughs> God damn it. I don't know. She's like, I have got a fruit. <laughs> She's a dead woman. She's an old woman. She's about, she's about to go down. Because look at her HP, it's only 50! I can only do Tattle once per turn. Yep. Oh, I freaking missed the input! I missed the freaking timing on that, damn it. <laughs> oh, that was a good movie. That's an old movie. 77 and 2. Go on, 77 and 2. Oh, wait a minute. Is that a defense? 
Wait, I have terrible defense, but I have a giant ass shot with spikes on it. Most most enemies in this freaking game have no defense or just one. That makes no sense. I'm a giant turtle with a shell. A shell is the perfect defense. How are you? How are you not have defense? God. Yeah, she's gone. Ah! Nothing left. Hey, twist! What's up? Oh! With a twist, what's up? What's up? Seventy HP. Let's see how far. Wait. Inside story uh, while you battle as Bowser, one of his defensive mechanisms is to crouch down so he covers himself with his black shell. But is this Bowser's inside story? True. Bro, they need to they need to like, do a they, they need to do a like collection of all the Mario and Luigi games. Oh, from like the, the Game Boy slash DS days. Like Dude, I man. I, okay, I, even though I had the DS, I missed out on some on the, the Mar uh, Super Mario for the DS. You remember that? I have the cartridge. I never got to play it because I never because every time when I try to go get get it, it's already gone. Aww. I love that game. Sure. Oh wait. You know I knew some of the tips and tricks about it. Like for instance, if you try to clear a, a, a the like the first level of each stage, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah. In, uh, with the with the timer around uh, three 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 or two 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 or one one one, you unlock a secret area. You go in there and you can get a free power up. Yeah, I think it's a three through three. If you do it that one, it's the mega mushroom they give you. No, it's random. Really? But you have a higher chance of getting it if you do two through three. Two 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 is a higher chance of getting like you know the, the one up house. Yeah. And then one 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 is like the basic power ups you find, like the the mush, mush yeah, the like mushroom, mushroom, the blue mushroom, shell, shell. Uh, what is this? I think was there one for the Tanuki power up? Uh, no. I think in New Super Mario Brothers on the DS, it was just the mushroom, the, flower, the, the mushroom, the flower, the uh the, shell, the. the mint. The mini. The mini mushroom and then the star, but the star never popped up there. Yeah, you don't get that. That was for certain special circumstances. Mm-hmm. Which was a long goal in my opinion. <laughs> Strangely enough, I had I did have Super Mario Advance. Super uh, yeah, Super Mario. Oh Where you got to play as like Luigi Toad and Beach as well. Yeah. And Regardless of what you do, it was ridiculously. Wait, was that Super Mario Advance like Super Mario Brothers 2? Kind of, but it was. Uh, but I tried playing it and it's freaking hard. Regardless of who you play as. I mean, I got I got past the first uh, uh, world, but that was about it. Because mm. you had the choice of playing the, the average. That, that game had two games. Where you play that, or you play the Mario Bros, the ones that have the pipes that are on the side. So. Oh, yeah. Makes me think back to, uh, like, if you do it, if you're doing uh, Super Mario Bros. 3 2 player, and. If you are King, if you are king you're King George VI. <laughs> if you know your history, if you know your history. Or he's King Henry VIII. He 
eats a lot and has to get a bunch of them. Uh-oh. you ever watch Open Focus? This is a black flame. Is that a witch? Or a black witch? <laughs> Decoration, damn it. Because they look like angler fish. They do. Like rat version of angler fish. Yeah. For a city that's filled with lights, it gets pretty dark easily with that. Oh my god! Even without a neon and the lights like this, we might be close to black dark! Wait a minute, doesn't it look nicer when it's, when it's dark outside? <laughs> Wait a minute. This isn't just your regular darkness. This is advanced darkness. I'm trying to remember where that reference is from. Rock bottom. <laughs> episode of Rock Bottom is one song. Thank <laughs> you. You're welcome. Thank you. When you try to use the low light, when you cut out of this low light, it just turns off almost immediately. Mm-hmm. I don't think it was advanced darkness, I think it was just cheap. Right? Mm hmm. Here we go. have truly awakened? No, this is unthinkable! Shadow Queen Peach. Witness my reaper. My soul is not yet fully accustomed to this vessel, but I'll learn to control this body soon enough. The beach! Yes, my glorious Shadow Queen, destroy these impudent fools! Who are you that would command me? What sort of being are you? Huh? What do you mean? I thought you were bound to obey the one who woke you! Enough of this prattle. Do as I say! Now, or I'll send you back to the depths of- You would do well to learn your proper place, slave. No one commands me. My 
powers are not yet fully restored, but they will come in time. Mario? I don't understand. My queen! You have returned to us! Ah, Beldam, what ages have passed? So, you're the one that truly responsible for calling me back, yes? Yes, my queen. I searched for a pure heart that you might inhabit. And as I did, I spread a rumor of a great treasure. Then I led the fools who had gathered the crystal stars here to open the seal. Yes, you all fulfilled your duties admirably. I am not worthy, my queen. And who are these beings that stand before me? Yes, they appear to possess some modicum of power and maybe of some use. Mortals, if you'll become my faithful servants, I will not harm you. Mario, I promise to follow you. I, I believe in you. Because of the fact that it's Peach and not Rosalina, I have to refuse. I'm sorry. If it was Shadow Queen Rosalina, I, I would for sure be down. <laughs> Then you wretched fools, you will learn the error of your ways. You're foolish to oppose me. That son of foolishness will have to be punished. Mario, I will follow you to the end. I swear it. I feel bad for the princess, but that queen must fall before us. And when she does, I'll tell you how I... Well, anyway, let's take this fight to her. Oh, so glad I got quick change, too. 150, attack is 7, defense is 0. Oh god. Oh, the music. No. Oh. Wait, hold on. Uh. Actually. I'm actually going to swap partners back to Vivian. useless than you appear. What is isn't familiar to me. It's not familiar. Let me assume my true form and show you real power. Oh! Now I- now I can't damage her. Shit! In this form, her attacks are like those of a child to me. You're lucky. You'll perish with the honor of having seen true terror and power. <laughs> I mean, I can't really do anything right now. Is that your idea of a tag? Foolish. Struggle as you might, it won't be enough. Ooh. 
No! I can't really do anything besides try to restore HP and FP until the cutscene starts up. Ah! Poison mushroom. Eh. That works for me. Nope. Not happening. Ah! Just... Missed. Oh. from any slight damage I've taken. And now, how I will punish you for your resistance. Uh, Mario, what will do? It could be done for. I'll ask you again. Will you serve me? If so, I'll forgive you for this. Forget it! I know we'll win. Very well. Then you will perish. What? What is this? Oh no? What's this shiny thing? Mayor, it's a crystal star! But I thought Mario had this thing. I wonder, kids. If this is related to the sky getting all dark and whatnot. Hmm. You may be right, but I don't know. But if anything's happened to my boy Coops and Mario. Oh dear. Oops, you're okay, right? You promised me you'd come back okay. Oh, 
Oh, the crystal star! What in the world? What's that doing here? This is very mysterious. Hmm, yeah, some mystery that. Snap out of it, Elder! Mori's in trouble! That's what the crystal star is here to tell us. I just know it. What? what could it be? Yeah, hey, you're right, Petunie. I can hear I can hear it. The crystal star is speaking to us. It's telling us that Mario's fighting to save the world, and he's in deep trouble. Flurry, come on, don't give up. You can do it, guys. Gonzalez, I mean, Mario. I know you're fighting far away right now. For us, for all of us. This crystal star has told us to fear last to brave stand. Maybe we can't do much to help you, but we're thinking of you. All our wishes are for you. For your victory. Well, yeah. Yeah, feel it. Rock out, Gon Great Gonzalez. Rock! Listen to me, Gonzalez. Anybody who's beat me is not allowed to lose. That's right. You, stop. Tell that shrimp that beat us to never give in. Fight! We're sending you all our strength, G-Man. You feeling the love out there? Gonzalez! Fight on, Mario. Losing is for losers, they say. <laughs> it makes sense. Don't you give up, Mario. Give it to him. Fight. Fight. Yeah, never give in. Believe in yourself. Fight. Mario, you may feel like it's going rough, like the tides have shifted against you. But if you lose, the world will be plunged into darkness forever. Please, don't give in. Vivian was her name, right? I'm a bit worried about the girl that was with Mario. I hope they're both okay. They'll be fine, all of you. Mario will never give up. Mario will stand true. I still remember how easily he took care of that monster who had cursed us. He must have faked in him. We must believe that light will return to our world. Right. Even the birds. Mario, don't give up. Don't go. You can do it. Come on, you British bumps! I can't bloom in the air! Fight, Bobby! Fight! Okay. Yeah, fight! Once more! Go! 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 Admiral Bobby, show them what a real sea bomb's made out of, mate. They're all okay. Do not fear, my dear. Luigi is my finest pupil. I'm quite sure he'll prevail. Well, I worried nonetheless. I still hope there is a future in which my little club can grow and prosper. Well then, I suppose all we can do is give him a resin cheer, hmm? So, I'm quite sure he can hear us through the power of this crystal. Darn right, Dad! Go, Gonzales! Go get him! Mario, Gonzales! Go, Gonzales! Go, go, Mario! Huh? Mario? G Gonzales? Not L Luigi? He's so confused. We're assembled, Mayor. Okay. Good work, my comrades. Now, let's do it. Ready? And... Mario! Mario, you can do it. Is that... 
Can you hear them, Mario? So many voices. The... They're all sending us their wishes and positive energy. That's so sweet. What? What are these vile voices? Mario, look at that! Oh, what is this? Light! Oh! Oh! Oh my god! Mario! That voice... Princess Peach? Mario, I... What? You wretched little girl! You disobey me! Mario! Take... Take the last of my power! What is this? I feel completely revitalized! You brat! Obey me, girl! Farewell, Mario. I believe in you. Peach! <sighs> Very cunning, princess. But you will not undo me. Know me as your queen! It's time to end this. Enough. This ends now. Damn right does. Oh, wrong. Frickin'. Damn it. Ah. Damn it. I hit the wrong frickin' button! Damn it! Salt Partners, Goombella. Nope! One fifty. attack 7, defense 1. First off, swap back to Vivian because that's. I will need her for sure. Supernova! Gets rid of the hands, that's for sure. Queen Fools. Oh, fuck's sake. Uh, I just want to see how much I can do real quick. Okay, just the thir 39 right there. Okay, not bad. Veil. Oh, wait a second. Oh! Bing 
Bingo! HP, Flower, and Sar. And it maxes out the audience, too. Oh, fuck. Oh, sh yeah, oh, totally. Seven again? Oh, wait. Wait, I'm in peril. Let's try. You stupid daisy. Oh, the hands are back. Oh, shit. Oh, Mario just got knocked out. Life mushroom. Guard is tricky to get down. Okay. Let's do Fiery Jinx. Bam. And she's burned too, so there's that. Son of a bitch! Oh hell. Let's go. you have done nope missed bitch oh Vivian Revive her right now. Bobbery, it's up to you to pick up where Vivian left off. I need a power bounce on the main. Damn it! Wait, 13, 13, 13, 13. Oh, we're so close! It don't matter. It's over.
I was about to do my uh, tip of my hat too, but then I realized I put I turned my hat backwards. <laughs> Damn it! How could I? I cannot be beaten by lesser beings such as these. I've just been reborn into this world. I cannot. I must not. My queen. Ugh. I guess we're in the clear, am I right? Not a real thing, I tell you. I seem to be in one piece too, also all as well. Take a look at this. Oh, frankly. Too bad. Having you around really did wonders for my research. Ah, Professor, we never let you monopolize Mario for your research anyway. Besides, you said I could be your research assistant for next term. <coughs> hmm. Yes, that's right. And I thank you, Gumbella. Mario, even after you leave here, please don't forget about us, alright? And we, in return, will wish that you find all the best in the future. Never give up, Mario. It's the most important thing I learned from you. Thanks, Mario. Just promise me you'll think of me now and again, okay? Um, uh, Mario, thanks to you, I found courage in my inner strength. I don't know how to say this, but I think I like myself more since I've known you. It's like, I've become a tiny bit more like my dad, you know? <laughs> it's also hard to put into words. Um... My dear, dear Mario. I'm ready to make my comeback in the theater now. I found so many things on this journey that I can only express on stage. And with these new themes, I'm so ready for that wonderful spotlight again. Please do come see me once we've finished rehearsing. I'm pink peach too, dear. Gonzalez? Oh yeah, wait, I've gotta stop doing that. It's Mario, right? Hey, it may be Mario, but to you, I'll always be Gonzalez. Glitch pit forever, buddy. Well, he'll always be Gonzalez to me, man. Because I was born in the Glitz Pit, and Gonzalez is, and always will be the champ. So let's meet again, Gonzalez. I made it, man. 
uh, Mario, I, I feel, I feel like I've grown to look. Yeah, um, never mind. Hey, I know what you were about to say, Vivian. I know what you were about to say. L O V E. Damn. I surely think that you and Peach make a nice couple. <laughs> I'll never forget my time traveling with you. So, don't forget me either. Well, boy, it was most agreeable that I had the chance to meet you. If not for you, then my dear Scarlet would still gaze down on a broken babam. But now, I'm off to sea again. I know Scarlet would have wanted it that way. Let's see each other again, Mario. And this time, let it be on the high seas, old boy. Well, <clears throat> it is time for us to part, my little cheese hunk. But I will not say farewell, because you're welcome here anytime. And since you're welcome, you should come anytime you please, sweetie. Now be careful, and until we meet again, adieu. Well, the boat's almost here. Mario! Junior! Petuni! Ah, we made it just in time. Take these with you. We brought them so you'd have something to eat on the boat. Yummy. These are very fresh mushrooms. Everyone, if not for all of you, the world would have fallen into a horrible darkness. But your brave hearts strove for peace and saved this world. I don't know how to thank you, but know that the entire world is in your debt. What nonsense! We're the ones who should be thanking you, Princess. If you hadn't come to our little town, we'd all be puppets for the Shadow Queen and Grotus. The thought gives me the thought gives me hives. Ah, look, Your Highness, I see the boat. Oh yeah. <laughs> oh, forgive my lateness, sir. I must have dozed off a bit. But please come on board. I'll get you folks back at full steam. Take care, everyone. Farewell. Set a course for the Mushroom Kingdom. They're all such lovely people, don't you think? I don't have too many good memories of Rockport, what with the kidnapping and all. <clears throat> but it really is a vibrant town full of love for life, isn't it? Mario, I was very frightened when they took me. But, well, Tech was really there for me and helped me get through it all. I knew that you would come to help me as well. I always believed in that. Thank you, Mario. M maybe I shouldn't wander off by myself quite so often. Positively shining. It's okay. I'm gonna, I'm gonna stop with the voice because otherwise I'm gonna throw like, throw my. I'm gonna kill my vocals. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I, I, my vocals can't handle it right now. Hmm. I just re I just realized in the credits, uh, or, or not in the credits, like in this little scene, they added in the picture frame of the Rogue Port partners, because you see the red one. You, you see at the bottom, there's Bobbery, you got Madame Fleury, Miss Mose, Vivian, and all of them. 
And obviously the one that the one next to it in the blue frame is the partners from Paper Mario 64. Because I see Paracarry, Lady Bo, Lackey Lester, Sushi, Bombette, Watt. Oh I have I still have my oldest 64. Maybe I should plug that in at some point. But now that Peach is safe, I guess everything's okay. There we go. How amazing is it that you saved the world again? Again, bro? And say, it's been a little while since then. Are you ready for a new adventure? Oh, yes. Yeah. You the man, bro. I wonder what everyone who traveled with you is up to. Oh. Whoa, what was that, bro? Was that your newfangled mail gadget? Yeah, Mario. What's up? Goombella here. I'm still here working with Professor Frankly. We beat the Shadow Queen, but there's tons of Rogueport lore we still don't get. So my research with the Professor goes on and on. With the info I gathered with you, we have lots of great leads now, though. Like I always said, every myth contains a kernel of truth. Speaking of which, no one was in the chest that the professor recovered? You're totally not gonna believe me when I tell you. It's a secret. <laughs> I'll tell you next time I see you. As part of my research, I did go back to many of the places we visited. And I saw everyone we traveled with too. Koops is living peacefully in Petalburg with his dad and Koopy Koo. And Mario, guess what Koops wants to do now? He wants to become mayor of Petalburg and live there in peace. Can you imagine? Still. It might just be perfect for him, come to think of it. He's so much more of an adult now than when you left Re Roadport. Still, I think Koopy Koo pretty much has him wrapped around her little finger. Possibly. That's one per That's one person I still need to fight, is the Atomic Boo. I ne it's like, there was a couple of secret bosses I never fought. It was... Secret Boo, uh, I think there's also the secret boss for Prince Mush and... Because Atomic Boo, I think, was in the original version, right? I can't remember. What she's doing right now is the story of our adventure. Yeah. Oh, Paper Mario. I saw it twice. Totally the best play ever. It's not Duplass has joined the troupe as an actor. Who saw that coming? I started him well, but it still kind of creeped me out. Oh, and Lord Yoshi? Yeah, he's fine. Solo in the glitz pit. He says he's getting pretty close to a time match, even. Isn't that just adorable? Oh, yeah, he's calling himself the Great Gonzalez. <laughs> the Great Gonzalez Jr. in the ring, by the way. It's sort of silly, but kind of cute, too, don't you think? Oh, and... Wait, I have to get this exactly right or he'll, like, get, like, so mad at me. Yeah, I said that he could totally take you in the ring now, so bring it. I guess he doesn't change. Isn't that too cute? Vivian's going back to hang out with the sisters. She wants to give them another chance. Now that the Shadow Queen has been defeated, I don't think Beldam is into evil. Our Beldam almost promised me she would never be mean to Vivian ever again. Yeah, but I think the three sisters are going to live pretty peacefully from now on. But you should totally go visit her sometime. Ahoy! Mario 
Robert goes out to sea every day now on Cortez's ship. I think his soul has healed. Has healed. I ran into him on Kilo Hall Key by accident the other day, which was nice. He was so happy. I thought he was going to blow up on me for a second. <laughs> you know, I bet Scarlet is looking down on him and smiling right now. Oh, and I almost forgot. Everyone on Kilo Hall Key is well, and they say hello. Finally, Miss Mose is still running the bed shop in Roadport, so she's happy. She comes over to Frankly sometimes to visit. But as usual, as soon as she sets foot outside the shop, she turns into a banja a badge ninja. She said just the other day that she had found some super rare badge action. And that's our globe trotting mystery making flirting little badge speak, huh? Go on, Miss Mose! Oh, God! Oh, yeah. In my travels, I heard a rumor that Lord Crump and Grotus were both still alive. I guess that makes them pretty tenacious baddies, doesn't it, Maria? But they've melded a lot, just like Beldam has, and I don't expect more trouble. Plus, I hear Grotus is just ahead, which really make, cuts down on mischief making. <laughs> Speaking of miracle survivals, guess whose favorite calculator is still computing? Says he really wants to see them peach again. Tech. Well, I'm totally rambling at this point, so I guess I'd better wrap it up. Just want to say, even though things got tough, I'm grateful for our time together. And. There is one thing that kind of weighed on me and I never got to express to you. See, I... Well, maybe that's best to kept a secret. Hey, you two. You and Vivian. Goomel, both you and Vivian were about ready to confess the love to Mario. <laughs> but please say hi to Peach for me, okay? Until we meet again, your friend, Goombella. Oh, that's awesome, bro. Sounds like everyone's doing great over there. Huh? Someone here? Excuse me, sirs. Hello, Mario. Oh, hello, Luigi. Please allow me to apologize for coming unannounced, but... I was playing out the storm in the castle the other day, and... I found something rather amazing. Tessa found a treasure map. And I'm sure it will lead to real treasure this time. I just know it! So Mario, you know look for treasure, isn't that right? The boat's waiting for you. To, I guess. <sighs> I don't think no matter how many times you play through this entire game, no matter like whether it's the remake or the original on the GameCube, it's going to be the same way every time. It is best, sto like, best story, like, 
This game is literally the definition of picture-perfect Nintendo. There's no other perfect... There, or better yet, this is just straight up picture-perfect Mario. Because this is literally one of the best Mario games ever made. Hell, it might as well just be, be the best Mario game ever made. It's a straight 10 out of 10. The story is perfect. The character, the character dialogue is spot on. The music is beautiful. Look, the only ma the only main thing about the game that people complain about is backtracking to back to Rogueport every single time. But to be fair, that makes sense considering that's where you have to go to put the star you grabbed at the Thousand Year Door. Prince Mush! It's like, yeah, this is, as far as perfect Nintendo games, this one's perfect from, like, picture-perfect Mario. If you want picture-perfect Pokemon, you're gonna have to go back to Generation 5 on the DS. I'm, there's no way around that. Legend of Zelda? Your best choice is gonna end up being Breath of the Wild. Or, but, like, either Breath of the Wild or potentially uh, Ocarina of Time. Now, if you ask me which version, original N64 Ocarina of Time. Not the crappy 3DS remake they did. Not many people liked that one. Flavio still gets scared by Cortez. Now, Metroid, however, that's a question mark, because a bunch of the Metroid games are really good. It also depends on which version you're talking about, like 2D Metroid, or you're talking about Metroid Prime? i say, as far as 2D Metroid, the best ones are between Fusion or Dread. And then I can't really say much on Prime because the only one I've played is Prime 1. I haven't... I never played Prime 2 or 3. Shigeru Miyamoto! Bowser. General Hey, Shinya Takahashi. Based on the work of Paper Mario Thousand Year Door original Nintendo GameCube version development staff. Not to mention intelligence systems. The end. Everybody do the wave. All right, now back to the other way.